on the warm side of a frontal boundary that is moving through the Midwest today. You can see that temperature divide still 74 in Lima right now, and we could reach the mid 70s over the next few hours. And temperatures are actually close to 80 down towards Columbus, but just north of us in Michigan, 60s and 50s. We have 59 in Chicago right now, 49 currently in Minneapolis. So all the way down in Oklahoma City, even those folks enjoying some cooler weather after some severe weather there last night. They're seeing temperatures only in the 50s right now in central Oklahoma. So this cold front is going to bring a big change all over the eastern half of the country as we head throughout the weekend, a big change. But this afternoon, we have to get through the chance for some strong storms. When you have the cooler weather meeting up with the warm air, a lot of moisture in place, that's uh, kind of set the stage here for some storms. We're still waiting for storms to develop here. We've got a little low pressure right here. It's not a very strong low sitting right over parts of northern Indiana. It's going to lift overhead this afternoon, and that will bring, of course, some more lift in the atmosphere for some showers and storms. A little bit of rotation as well, which is why we have to mention the possibility for an isolated brief spin-up tornado. That's a low threat, but not a zero chance of that occurring here. You can see right now, uh, nothing too impressive, but some heavier showers around Rockford right now northern parts of Mercer County, some showers in the portions of uh, Van Wert as well. We have also some rain increasing around the Lima area. So the trend in the next few hours, just know the rain chances are going to pick up and we'll see more in the way of those showers. We have that risk for severe weather that has been expanded just a little bit northwest. Not a big change with the last update, but they did expand it just slightly and now encompasses all of Allen County with the risk for severe weather. So again, it looks like in that 2 p.m. to about 6 p.m. window, just stay weather aware. I think especially southeast of Lima is your best chance, but here's the good news by 6 p.m. Things are starting to improve. We'll actually see a break, it looks like, this evening. As we go from that 6 p.m. to about 10 p.m. window, that's good timing there for the high school football games tonight. But then you notice more rain to the west. That is going to push in after midnight with showers. And then we'll see those showers exit by about sunrise tomorrow. And here's the good news. Tomorrow we'll have some dry weather to get outside, but much, much cooler. Boy, we're going to have to change the wardrobe here. 59 on Saturday, 42 Sunday morning. But as you can see, next week we rebound to near 70 with mostly sunny skies.